Hey everyone, welcome back to a new video. Um, do please excuse the odd bang that you hear. It's currently bonfire night. Um, so, I haven't picked the camera up in a little while. And to be fair, the last week I've been pretty poorly. Um, or I say the last week, no. Over the weekend I was poorly. Today is currently Thursday. Um, I got sent home from work a week ago. I had what I thought was the start of a migraine. Didn't really feel any better until Sunday. Um, and then I started with a cold. Bunged up nose, couldn't smell anything. And then I noticed that it wasn't really a cold. Didn't have a runny nose. Yes, I've got a bunged up nose. I mean, you can hear it a little bit in my voice. Um, and no fever, no nothing. And then yesterday, I decided to get myself a corona test, um, COVID test. And today it came back positive. So for the last week, obviously I've been at home anyway, but for the last week, I've actually had COVID which Chris was convinced I didn't have because um, if you have watched my channel before you will have heard me mention that I am an asthmatic and quite a severe asthmatic I'm on a steroid inhaler um, two or three times a day depending on how bad it is and up to now touch wood um, I um, haven't had any chest problems. The only problems I have had was achy fatigue um, for about three days, like full body fatigue. Just couldn't bring myself to get off the off the sofa. Never mind do anything else. Um, headaches, just all my joints aching. And then, as I said, I thought I was starting with a cold, a bunged up nose, um, sneezing. And then, I probably would say that I've noticed it from the beginning, but my sense of smell hasn't been right. And then, all of a sudden, my sense of smell is nothing. <laughs> I can't smell a thing. Um, so, yeah. I have currently been self-isolating at home for the last week, last seven days. I now have three days left of my self-isolation because it is ten days for me. Unless, obviously, I still feel poorly come my tenth day. And, yeah. It is not <laughs> any of the symptoms that they tell you that you could have. So, a new continuous cough. I haven't really got a cough. The only time that I cough is when I take my inhaler morning and night, which it do, it can make me cough anyway. Um, I've not had a temperature. We've got a thermometer at home. I've been checking my temperature since I got sent home ill last Thursday. And the only other one is your sense of smell and taste. My taste is absolutely fine. My smell, as I said, nothing. <laughs> literally nothing but it hasn't affected my taste at all like I could get this is my cleaning cover by the way that I'm going into I could get unscrew this um cap off the vinegar would not be able to smell a thing which is very very strange um and as I said at first I thought it was a migraine then I thought maybe it was like cold flu maybe and then I decided, wait, maybe I should get a COVID test. I don't want to be putting anyone else at risk. Um, and I did. And I got, I had a test yesterday at about half past, well, my slot was 11.30 till 12. And I got my results back at five past five this afternoon. So, yeah, I've actually done a week's self-isolation without realising which is a good thing, but as I said, if um, if I'm still having problems or still not feeling great come uh, Monday, then I will still carry on self-isolating. But in 
myself, I feel absolutely fine. Um, I've done my housework today, washing, hoovered through. Um, yeah, um, I'm not saying the, the scientists are wrong, but for me, I've been very lucky, especially being an asthmatic, I have been very lucky indeed. Um, so I thought I'd just do a nice little weekend vlog. I'm hoping to do some Christmas crafting stuff this weekend. Um, I think I'm going to do some Christmas cards tomorrow and then I need to clean out under the stairs which is where all my which is my christmas cupboard <laughs> that's why i call it my christmas cupboard um to be able to get the bauble wreath out because i am redoing my wreath from last year and i've also ordered a garland um to decorate as well so i need the baubles from that to be able to start on my christmas decorations um so that's probably the plan for tomorrow. So I thought I would share with you. Um, I will film on my camera. This is my phone. I thought I'd just pick up my phone and talk to you, share what's been going on. Um, because you will have noticed I've been very quiet the last month. Work has just been hectic. And then, as I said, the last week I've been quite poorly. Um, or I was poorly for about three days. And then since that, I've been fine. Apart from not being able to smell, which is very strange. And I've got a new candle that I want to burn. But I haven't yet because I can't smell it. And it's a bit of a waste if I burn it and can't smell it. So I'm hoping my sense of smell comes back. Because it's a gorgeous Christmas one. Or it was when I bought it. It was a gorgeous Christmas one. I'm hoping that it still is. Um, so yeah. How are you all doing? Let me know down in the comments how you're all doing with this uh, pandemic and this new lockdown that we've gone into today. Um, so yeah, let me know how you're all doing. Good evening everyone. It is Saturday night. Um, I have had a super lazy day. Um, I don't even think I picked up the camera today. Well, I know I haven't picked up the camera today, but I don't even think I picked it up, to ye picked it up yesterday. I think it's all tongue-tied. Um, I had a bit of a tired day today. Um, had a nap on the sofa, I must admit. I have noticed since being poorly that um, I have to tend to have a nap, um, which is great. <laughs> an excuse to sleep. Um, but yeah, I can sleep for a good couple of hours, like on an evening. Um, but I'm doing good. Like I say, had a lazy day today. Tomorrow I'm gonna actually do something. Got some housework to do, some washing. Um, but yeah, I thought I'd just check in, say hi. I'm doing all right. My sense of smell is starting to come back. Not not like really really well but i can smell certain things um my yankee pumpkin spice latte candle i can smell it <laughs> um so yeah since the smell is starting to slowly come back um it's been nine days since my symptoms started nine nine days i think um me and Chris are actually self-isolating until Wednesday. My self-isolation can end on Monday, but Chris has to do 14 days and there's no point in me going out when he can't. So we are both staying in until Wednesday. I managed to get food slopped click and collect at Asda. Normally I do Tesco, but completely booked up for like the next 10 days and we normally do our food shopping like tomorrow, well, Monday, it's actually two minutes past midnight, so it's technically Sunday, um, but yeah, we normally do our food shopping on Monday, so obviously we're starting to get low on like fresh stuff, um, so I've managed to get one for Wednesday when we can start going out again, um, but yeah, doing alright. Um, yeah, let me know 
how are you all doing? Good morning. Just, I think it's about half eleven. Have a look. Uh, yeah, it's bang on half eleven actually. Um, been awake a while. Um, I've already done a load of washing. Um, changed the cat's litter trays, fed them. Um, and now I'm just chilling. Honestly, I've not got any energy lately. Um, so I'm just watching old um so ella um well so he sub vlogmases because they just get me in the festive mood so i'm watching i don't even know what year this is um 2017 maybe yeah i think 2017 um so i'm just watching that the cats are doing something they shouldn't be um, I'm going to get myself another drink because I've not actually drunk enough yet this morning. Um, I have found that that really helps me feel a lot better. Um, if I drink plenty. Um, but yeah. I've just got two more loads of washing to do. That is the plan for today. And then depending on what time I get that finished, I need to strip the bed in and get that done. Um, but apart from that. I'm just trying to feel better. I don't sound as bunged up today, um, but my nose still feels, I know it sounds weird, like feel like I've got pressure like here, um, but um, I don't feel as bunged up today, which is helping I think with like my sense of smell coming back slightly. Apparently it can take up to a month. But I can smell little things, so slowly get in there. Um, please excuse my hair, it needs colouring, it needs refreshing. But I've got no gloves and my hairdryer, um, I had to leave it to dry naturally the other day when I washed it because my hairdryer is at work. And obviously I can't go out and get it at the minute, so I can't wait for Wednesday. <laughs> I can go, go get food shopping for one, go... Um, get some gloves and my hair dryer because look how faded my hair looks on the ends um it's been three weeks since i've had it colored yeah three weeks since i've had it colored and obviously how blonde i was underneath it does need refreshing but um i don't want orange hands so i need some gloves and as i said i need a hair dryer as well so cannot wait for Wednesday <laughs> um I can technically as I said go out tomorrow and get it but it's kind of not fair that I can go out and Chris can and what's the point in Chris self-isolating and me not so we'll just wait until Wednesday morning um yeah um so we're getting there making our way through this um actually i think i can go out from today but i'm really not in the mood to <laughs> i'm really not feeling it so i am staying in with chris until wednesday and once chris is back at work on wednesday even though he doesn't work during the day but once he's back at work on wednesday um i'm gonna get ready for christmas get some um christmas crafting done i've just got three presents left to buy um well three people left to buy um my dad and my sister's fiance i know what i'm getting them chris i'm a bit on an iron want to get him so um i want to start thinking about that in the next couple of weeks I ordered my dad's um, birthday present last night because his is the first week of December so I've got that ordered I ordered a couple of bits from Amazon and um, decorations wise still haven't had a notification um, I don't know if I've told you but I ordered a new garland I'm still waiting for it to come um, I ordered it a week ago now um, and I'm still waiting on a dispatch notification Apparently it can take up to 28 days. I want it now. I want to, I want to get it 
sorted. Um, so, God knows when that's going to turn up. Um, but I am planning on filming a new Christmas decor, um, like things that I've bought for the tree, garlands, everything like that. Um, and then when I decorate, I'll do a full walkthrough what I've got. Um, because I have have spent a little bit on Christmas decorations this year. Um, obviously last year was the first year in this house. Um, and I didn't really know, um, what space I had and things like that to dress, if that makes sense. Um, so I've bought a few extra bits through throughout the last month or so um there's a few bits still left to come so i am just waiting on them coming um good morning um so i realized that yesterday i actually got cut off uh, my sister actually facetimed me while I, was, while I was vlogging was on the phone for about 45 minutes and then completely forgot to pick pick it up again um it is 10 o'clock, just after 10 o'clock. Um, Luna, Luna keeps trying to get to my inhaler. Uh, she's fascinated with it because it makes a noise. Um, <clears throat> yesterday, I managed to get three loads of washing done, emptied the washing basket. Hey, get out of there, you bugger. Um, <clears throat> yeah, managed to get three lots of washing done, got the wash basket emptied. Um, did a little bit of painting craft wise um, did a couple of get out of there no come on you can't have mummy's inhaler and there's creams and that in there that I don't want you to get into I've got a little basket <clears throat> I'm not going to show you the underneath of my coffee table because I need to do some tidy and that's today's plan but I've got a little basket which I've got like little essential bits in so like a lip balm moisturizer my inhaler my pill little bits like that little notebook um and luna loves loves it <laughs> um but yeah so today as i just said plan is to do a little bit tidy and hoover up um i've got another load of washing in with the throwovers in from the sofa we have throwovers on our sofa just to reduce the scratching from the cats you can't stop it completely, but it just protects the seats a little bit. Um, and today they're in one of them scratchy fighty moves. So I would just happen to take them off today, wouldn't I? Um, I'm going to make some donuts later. Um, what else? Um, I think I might actually... Well, I'm enjoying this one. I've just put candle on. I've just lit the candle. My sense of smell is nearly, I would say, 90% back. So I'm enjoying it. I'm putting a candle on today. Um, I can smell my candles. I can smell, I've just sniffed the wash liquid, like the wash gel. I know it sounds silly, but you kind of take, hey, there's a candle on there. You kind of take your smell for granted. It's been so strange not being able to smell anything at all kind of look not looking forward to it because now i'm going to be able to smell the cat's litter tray um which is great <laughs> um but yeah my sense of smell i would say is probably 89 80 to 90 percent back now and uh, like i say i'm making the most of it i've got candle on already and it's 10 o'clock in the morning but i don't care because i've ordered myself a new one um food shopping i am collecting wednesday morning as you can tell i'm feeling so much better than sort of three days ago but um yeah i've done food shopping and last christmas i actually kept it careful luna i actually kept it so i knew which one it was and it's the yankee candle home which some of these aren't that strong, but the one that I've got burning now is, and that's the vegan, um, pumpkin chai latte, I think it is. Um, yeah, pumpkin chai latte, it's one of the autumn scents, it's this one. And then the winter one, the Christmas one that I love, is Glistening Christmas. And I actually kept it, I mean, it's completely 
doesn't look it but it is completely burnt down but I kept it so I knew which one it was to get this year this can actually go in the bin now um but they were on offer um at Asda so this is a medium jar I got the large one for nine pound which I think they were normally about 14.15 so bargain <laughs> did end up spending like 90 odd pound on my food shopping bought my turkey Chris told me I was crazy um, well I'm getting planning ahead I am planning ahead um so yeah bit cleaning today bit of freshening up I did go around and um anti back all of our touchable surfaces yesterday so kitchen door handles light switches banister remotes phone everything like that i did all that yesterday um but i probably will go around and do that again it doesn't take long um it just whiz round everywhere and then i need to hoover and do a bit of bit cleaning bit tidying up Obviously, when you're not feeling great, you don't tend to do a great deal. I've got the pots from last night's tea to put away. Um, so yeah, just general tidying and then I can make donuts. <laughs>